Hey everyone, this is a rhythmic series problem given s sub 3 equals 9 and s sub 6 equals 90. We need to find s sub 10. And what this is saying is the first three uh, terms add up to 9 and the first six terms equals 90 and we need to find the sum of the first 10 terms. So we get started, and um, here's your summation formula for arithmetic series. And we know that for the first one, our n equals 3 for this number here. So I'm going to fill this in, and um, s sub 3 is 9, so 9 equals 3 divided by 2 times your first term plus your last term. And for um, this one, n is 6, so you have um, 90, because that's 90, your total sum, equals 6 divided by 2 times u plus u sub n. Therefore, what I'm going to do next is simplify these equations by multiplying um, this first one by two-thirds. Um, and you just distribute here, and you're going to get uh, 18 divided by 3 is 6 equals u plus u sub n. And for this one, I'm going to multiply both sides of the equation by one-third. This just equals 3. So that gives you 30 equals u plus u sub n. All right, so now what we want to do is find our u sub n. And we can do that by using this formula. So basically we have 6 equals uh, u plus u sub n, and 30 equals u plus u sub n. Now u sub n equals u plus n minus 1 times d. So for our this one, this was n equals 3, recall, and this one's n equals 6. So we're going to plug those in. So we're going to get equals for this one. u plus 3 minus 1 times d. And for this one, I'm going to get u plus 6 minus 1 times d. So therefore, if you simplify this, you're going to get, simplify those two, you get u plus 2d, and this one is going to be u plus 5d. So now, I'm going to plug these back in to this u here. So we're going to we're going to get 6 equals u plus u sub n and this u sub n is u plus 2d and our 30 equals u plus u sub n when you substitute you get u plus 5d. So this one was where n is 3 and this was n equals 6. Now using process of elimination I'm going to subtract each term to eliminate my u. So that gives me negative 24 these two cancel equals negative 3 d. If you divide both sides by negative 3 you get d equals 8. So now that we have that, we can substitute it back into our equation to find our first term, which is u. So basically we had 6 equals 2u plus 2d, and 30 equals 2u plus 5d. Now, our d was 8. So I'm going to go ahead and plug it into this first one. 
we get 6 equals 2u plus 2 times 8. And that's going to be 6 equals 2u plus 16. Subtract 16 from both sides. And you're going to get negative 10 equals 2u. And divide both sides by 2 and you get u equals negative 5. So now we have our common difference and we have our first term is negative 5. So what this kind of looks like is our first term is negative 5. Then you're going to add 8 for your common difference, which is 3. Add 8, you get 11. Now again, recall that our sum of our first three terms was 9. And if you add those together, you do get 9. So let's add three more terms. Uh, add 8, and you get 19. Add 8, you get 27. Add 8, you get, um, let's see, 36. And that should all add up to uh, 90 And when you add it all up. So we've got add six terms here. And that gives you 90. So they want to know what the next, the sum of the next term is. So we've got to find this term to do the sum. And that's our last step. So our sum of the 10th term equals a 10 divided by 2 times our first term plus u sub n, our last term. We don't know our last term. That's your last term. We do know our first term is negative 5. Our n in this case is 10. And we don't know u sub n. So um, I can write this out as 5 times negative 5 plus u sub n. So to find u sub n, we're going to write our uh, 10th term. So that's u sub 10 equals, um, let me just write the formula first. So u sub n equals u plus n minus 1 times d. So u sub 10 is going to be your first term plus n, which is 10 minus 1, and your d equals 8. This we don't know yet for this problem. All right, so that's 8. So our 10th term, or our last term with what we need, is negative 5 plus 9 times 8. This is 72, so our 10th term is 67. Negative 5 plus 67, or negative 5 plus 72. Now we can plug our uh, 67 into our u sub n and finally solve. So our 10th term is 5 times negative 5 plus 67. And that gives you negative 5 plus 67. Let's make sure I do it right. So that's 5 times 62. And that's going to give you uh, 310. And that's your final answer. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.